everybody. In this video you join me in Białowieża National Park looking for European bisons in the snow. That's hopefully what we'll get and let's go find them. So the plan is to find European bison on the meadows when they're feeding because they need 50 kilograms of vegetation and right now in the winter it's easiest for them to find it on the meadows and hopefully we might get some snowfall because the clouds and the weather forecast says it will snow so hopefully we will get the shots in really heavy snowfall but we will see about that So we arrived at the location and we just spotted a family of bison so now it's time to dress up and see what we can do When sneaking up to bison, it's important to give them enough time to acclimatize to you. Therefore, the way I approach is by walking 10, 10 to 20 meters and lying down for 3 meters, so they have time to accept that something is there. Uh, and repeat the process till I get ab to about 50 meters, which is the safe distance to photograph them from my experience and from what the science says. to sneak up to them to the the right amount and right now we are trying to uh, to see if they do something but we are thinking of moving on because they are starting to lay down and we so I'm shooting upper to priority with over one stop of overexposure to get the white snow not the gray snow but the camera usually likes it likes to make it so I'm overexposing by one stop so three clicks and uh, and that allows me to get the white snow that we all know the snow is white so that's the plan so they nearly moved but this is the type of shots that I was going for this really minimalistic just one bison on the plane but as you can see right now uh, they're just over here and we can self right any, so I'm thinking about going back and switching locations to the The second day greeted me with frozen windows of the car and fresh snow. I decided to drive 80 kilometers north to the new place I've never been before. So we arrived at the another location, the one that we never went to, and there is over uh, over 80 bison in front of us, which is amazing. They are in this field covered in snow, so another great opportunity to get minimalistic shots, and I will show you them in just a minute. Check this out, all of the bison right here. I attached the 2x teleconverter because the bison have a really nice snow on their face and I'm trying to show the mood of it so I'm shooting portraits this time to get the variety of the shots previously I was shooting minimalistic now I'm shooting uh, close-ups to get the better portfolio of shots As 
As you can see, we are fairly close and the snow is falling beautifully. I'm trying to show it off in my pictures, but I never know which way is better. The shutter speed of about 1 one hundredth of a second or 1 two thousand of a second. The first one gives those dramatic lines, but the second one looks more like moment capture in time. Let me know in the comments which one do you like more. We just found another bull, uh, this time it's one bison and uh, he's feeding on the haystack as I told you before they do, so probably we won't get any nice natural looking shots but at least it's nice to see him and I will show you the behavior in a second. That's the bison's foot. As you can see it's pretty big comparing to my hand and I have pretty big hands because I can grab palm my basketball and I'm wearing the Heat Company gloves when you, you can use co promo code that's on the screen right now to get 10% off and I will make a review of them in the next video but for now I'm very very happy. A trip to Białowieża sadly came to an end and so does this video. So if you enjoyed it please leave a like and subscribe. So hopefully in the future I will get to show you more behind the scenes video from my wildlife photography adventures. See you soon.